Well, heat 14, and the interest here is centred on Doug Wire on the right of your picture. The former Sheffield Tiger now with Halifax. Unbeaten with nine points. Next to him will be Steve Baker, then David Barge, and on the outside, Rob Ashton in grid four. But it's Doug Wire looking for his fourth win of the night and hoping to set up a Heat 18 Grand Slam finale with the new hero of the Owlet crowd, Sean Moran. Before that, we've got to see Wire and Moran win their fourth rides. And certainly looking at the competition here, Doug Wire on the fourth, he's shown us tonight, shouldn't make any mistakes, but then it's fatal to say things like that. Let's see what happens as Doug Wire makes the trap in gate one. Away he goes into the lead. Challenged by David Barge on the outside, and is David Barge going to get past him? Steve Baker and Rob Ashton, but what a terrific scrap up punch between uh, Dave Barge and Dougie Wire. And Dougie Wire really is producing the form there, look at that, as he goes into that turn with David Barge on the outside, but the young New Zealand are not giving any ground at all, and there's just about a lap and a quarter to go now. Wire's tried the outside, he's tried the inside, and finishing on this last lap. He's right on Barge's tail now as they go around that turn into the back straight for the last time, but it looks as though Barge is opening up the lead now. Wire made the start, but the younger man got past him and did the job. Dave Barge comes down to take the flag, Dougie Wire in second place in third spot, Steve Baker, and that's Doug Wire's first defeat of the night. <laughs>